This is unbelievable. It's sunny out today. We are going to walk down the beach to the Pirate Tower and check out how blue the water is. I just can't figure out the weather here. It was supposed to be the coldest day, but the sun came out. It's so beautiful. Okay, we're trying not to get too wet on the way down to Pirate's Tower, so we're doing a little rock scrambling. Without shoes on, it might be a little bit painful, but got to tough it out. halfway to Pirate's Tower and we have to pass through this Arches Cove. Um, if you can make it midday, it's low tide and it looks so beautiful. So, so far we're about halfway and we've been able to walk on the beach with no problem. So just on the other side of this arch is a bunch of tide pools with some really cool things to see. You just got to do a little rock scrambling. cove was the one area where I wasn't really sure if we were going to be able to make it on the beach side down to Pirate's Tower, but we did. I only had one fail where I tried to jump off the edge by that little cave and I slipped, but camera equipment's okay, so definitely doable. Oh my god, and the most magical house is up here on the hill. So I'm pretty sure this next rock cliff we're not going to be able to climb over. Dun, dun, dun. We'll see. We'll see. All right, well, we couldn't make it all the way through, so we came up the steps and we're in this little neighborhood street. Walk in to try to find the Pirate's Tower. I'm determined. And there's quite a bit of construction going on around here. Lesson learned about Southern California, never trust the weather report. Today was supposed to be the coldest day and it is beautiful and it's hot when you're walking. So you come down the end of the street and it's a steep incline so it's going to suck going back but the beach looks absolutely stunning. We're almost there. So here's the big incline we just walked down and the Pirate Tower is just on the other side of this hill right here. So if you come to the main Victoria Beach, you're going to be way back there. I think you can see it behind me. Um, but we were kind of looking for the shortest path. And since we walked, it's been kind of a hike. And there's not many people here, so I am really happy. for somebody rich. I think he was a senator that lived in the area and now it's become somewhat of a landmark. So I had to make sure we saw it and I captured that image uh, for the vlog. That's what it takes to get here from the Pacific Edge Hotel. I'm dying. That was so steep. I'm so out of shape. Let's hope I lose a few pounds on this trip. That hill just about killed me. 
is so steep, but we did it. And then you have to cross under Highway 1. And then there's a staircase to go up. It's a little quicker than walking down and up on that Victoria Road since the Victoria staircase is currently closed.